Okay, hi guys. We are living from our place, and there's so many interesting things to see while we are walking towards the side shop. So we are gonna walk around and talk. That's it, right? Yep. Where we are living, it is a really local area. So we are the only foreigners expect living in this uh, place. You go, ba to shimera. This is got a little safety thing attached. Uh huh. Oh, 경찰인데. <laughs> 아 친구구나. <laughs> 난 무슨 일 있는지 알았다. So over there, there's a butcher shop. If you are kind of sensitive about the animals. And I guess you guys need to skip 10 seconds, but it's a unique part of the butcher shop is that they are selling camels. Camel legs and some other butcher shop has the uh, camel hat too. But we haven't tried it yet, right? No. <laughs> oh, can't see that. You don't see this kind of car seat every day. This is the uh, local mosque right here. When you come by here on Friday, this whole area all those uh, sidewalks are just full of people who are praying. Oh, this is where we get our donuts, right here. Yeah. This is the... Uh... <laughs> this is the uh... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, this is the Salamalaikum. There's another camel meat selling place too. Be careful. Crossing the uh, streets here in Morocco can be quite treacherous. Off the way. So you gotta, be, uh, you, gotta, you gotta keep your wits about you. Yeah. Today it's a little cold. I usually take off my jacket. Yeah, I hope he lives there. <laughs> I hope so too. <laughs> That's recycling guys. What do the local little alleys look like? In Morocco, one unique thing is the uh, when the bu building is so colorful, like uh, pink, yellow, or some that kind of color. This is school, right there. That is a school. We wish this was finished so we could uh, stay here instead of where we're staying. It's so nice. Let's get in. Mark really liked this, this fan yeah. a lot. Semi abandoned here. I like the structure. Linda! Apa? There's the uh, chickens that are always in the background in every video. <laughs> no aiming today, huh? And uh, still fishing? Fishing? No? Ah, travail. Ah, wait, 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 okay. Ta da! This is how we walk every day. And nighttime is quite different, but we usually go back home before it gets dark, right? <laughs> so. It, some, someday, maybe, if, we, if we're brave enough, we'll show you what it looks like when we go home. <laughs> well, I got picked by so many kids. We always get picked on by kids. And I get angry. <laughs> <laughs> I have to hold Lucy back. And yeah, Lucy's like, like, Lucy, you gotta calm down. They're a young kid. Like, no, I'm a young kid too. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go work. Let's get to work. Mm. Guys, um, before I jump on the work, there's a mark. Shy guy. Hello. <laughs> so, I wanna show you something interesting. So, here is like Hyatt Shop, it has a lot of Volkswagen and a classic. If you guys love classic cars, you know, definitely this is a place. This is special editions, it's Adman's car. So this is the Volkswagen and they are tearing apart and working on the car. This is really cool. They are like kind of like put the putties and then sanding and rusty part is almost gone. And look at this. This is awning. And the other one is... I hope that you guys remember the Eamon. Eamon is the uh, boy dad in a side son and he has Volkswagen. Uh, he's working on it. Seriously, like I admire his uh, passion. 
Look at this car. This car is Eamon's car and he's gonna make the uh, camper van. There's a lot of rust part but he said that when he bought it inside of the engine everything was in good condition. Just you know like a rust part. He need to work on it. You can see here right? He start to do welding and metal work too. This one is here. Is the what Eamon did. Eamon is like took down the rusty part and then he made this one with a hand and this one is here too. You know originally like you can see the how many color this Volkswagen has you know like there's five layers underneath of this black paint I think that's the reason why Van was protected pretty well. <laughs> So yeah, he's working on that one. I cannot wait to see, you know, he, when he finish it. So this is nice. <laughs> Whenever I do vlog, the the chicken love to talk to me seriously. On this side, it's not perfectly flat. It's up about a millimeter on some spots. Mm -hmm. So, anyways, um, still fit in there. This is the uh, face frame bottom part. Uh huh. So we are gonna screw it, right? Yeah. Screw it is not curse, right? Drill it. Just drill it. And then screw it. Screw it. But we gotta... No, no. Screw it is not curse, right? Like screw oh, yeah. you. <laughs> it can't be. Screw it. Like I don't care. Okay. okay English is hard. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> mm. Oh, big, big. So this one is what Mark uses as a drill guide so that when we drill it, it will be a nice hole to get in. So yeah, it's like our recycled wood because this one is a deal from original 2B 1.0. So yeah, we're using that one and one drill is done. Drilled in and screwed in is done and we are gonna put the uh, front frame here, the cabinet door too, hopefully. We don't need to adjust that much, right? Uh, we're gonna have to adjust it. Yeah, not, not that much, but <laughs> okay. Meet me back here next year And I'll be fine by then Mark is working on the front cabinet and like he doesn't need a hand right now, so I'm gonna go to uh, fix the uh, the screw hole that we are not gonna use it because like we made a, a little bit of mistake here and there. But you know, you know, you can fix with a wood filler. That's what I learned from the YouTube. So watch a little bit of video yesterday, and then previously we went to Purikuma, which is kind of tool store that we can buy. So we bought the, this one. Luckily, there's English, so I can read it. Let's <laughs> see. Oh. This is overfilled it. That is the thing. I hope they will make fun of me. Where's it going on? Oh! Wow! What do you think of this? Ah! Oh! What do you think of this? Alright, guys. Uh, <laughs> we are still working on the uh, front cabinet, also fixing the wood right now. Uh, one thing I didn't notice was um, our. Uh, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> one thing I didn't notice was the yeah, our wood is like yeah, it's quite splitting a lot. But when I rechecking the uh, slats and everything is slowly like um, breaking apart, so I cannot take that one, and I'm just uh, fixing here and there and while I'm doing it I saw the um, the, the guy came over and then see uh, our car actually um, I think once a week or tw 
once a week, where every two weeks we see the uh, some uh, local people came here and then look our car, how you know like we are building it, also our high roof. I think today the the person is a kind of customer. I think the, he was focused on checking our high roof, how it built, roll bar, and then some of the uh, uh, structure. So they are demonstrating uh, with our other roof. We bought it as when we bought this roof, it was a one plus one. <laughs> so they are putting the Volkswagen and then see how it looks. It looks good. So I think if they do, that would be great. I'm glad that, and I hope that that is this hide a customer. And yeah, it be, it's nice. <laughs> we are kind of like a sample car here. And then um yeah, as long as like some customer come, we are willing to show our things. Anyways, yeah, let's get back to work. Oof. Definitely not strong enough to hold the whole door up, huh? Yeah. Good morning, to be Cruz. Next day, we uh, had a struggling with the uh, cabinet door. This is kind of soft closing hinges. It's not holding our door that much. It's not strong, even we put the two. This one, we bought it just in case uh, something goes wrong. <laughs> and. It is right choice. So it's working perfectly for us. It's holding the door like up like this. And then we can close and then slow closing method. That's nice. So this one is almost done. And then this one is like open right now because we have to work on. And then top part. Top is open storage and it's done. And then this pocket hole you can see it right now, but we are gonna cover it up with this when we did the uh, 2B 1.0 build was like four or five years ago in Korea with this fan. So I bought it this one that time. I want to use that kind of you know like a folding holder hanger. So we couldn't use it that time because we didn't have place to put it. And then it's shorty van. I mean height is short, so we cannot do it. But now we can do it. This will go up here and cover the pocket hole. And then also we can hang something in the air. Perfect. Finally, we are gonna do the painting today. I'm gonna do paint it today, no matter what. No more details. I'm gonna like just like move on. It's just like seriously. Let's do it. Guys, we are ready for painting. This is the uh, color mixtures. We put it in the paint can and then, you know, change color a little bit of off-white. Are you ready? That's right. All right. <laughs> just do a little bit at a time, huh? Yeah. Oh. What is that? This is well, watery. You can mix it first. Let me just mix it. Should I try? Maybe one second. Just mix a little bit more. That's oh, the yeah. Thicker. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> oh, so yellow. Don't right? worry, there's a lot of paint in there. Yeah. Like falling deeper, cold and nice that no more shit on. Keep that leaky end and no more Alright, guys, we paint partially and we want to try out how it looks. We like the color, we both agree. But paint was quite weird, right? Paint was quite weird, right? Kind of chalky. To get on my hands, Mark is cleaning up right now. We start to paint pretty late, but somehow this. Paint dries so quickly, amazingly, it's so quick. So it's partially drying right now, and then we are gonna come back later and then start to paint other stuff. So we have to work on the front cabinet, but Mark says it's working good. 
And look at Mark's cute glove pocket. <laughs> Alright, sun is setting right now and we are gonna go back home. So, if you... Oh yeah, today another surprise. I feel kind of, we call it in, in, in Korean like a minpe. It's just like, oh too much, you know. I feel kind of sorry, <laughs> feel bad. But Eamon's uh, mom and his hide wife is making some special musman bread. So we are waiting for it. <laughs> really, I love her food actually. She's a really, really great cook. Um, yeah, so we're gonna wait for that one and then eat bon appetit. <laughs> so anyways, our work is done today. And if you make this video so far, click the like button and then leave the comment below and it always give us the uh, boost energy so i want to say a special thanks to our tv crew membership members and then patreon and i'm gonna put the names around here and then see you next vlog oh. see what this is all about <laughs> Right. <laughs> 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 <laughs>